I saw the video and I'm watching it and I'm like, huh, he's still watching my, yeah. you know, he's still watching my videos, watching my channel. And, uh, and I said, is he, is he talking about you? <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what he was talking about. I, I picked up on that right away. I, you know, <laughs> it, it didn't done on me. It, wait a minute now. It, it didn't done on me until later in the video. And I'm over here like, huh, is he talking about you? He was like, well, you know, I've seen, <laughs> I seen the interview with, uh, with let's, let's just call him Chip. And I'm like, huh, yeah. the only person, <laughs> that, you know, he was talking about the lease and all like that. And I'm like. Nah, he can't be talking about you, bruh. Old Chip. Old Chip in his interview. Trying to talk smack about his five, seven hundred truck company, and old Chip is out there. <laughs> yeah, that little that dude was talking about me, man. He fucking uh I saw it and I was like, alright. Because I have a response video ready, but I'm not putting out that official response. I figured I'm just gonna uh I'm gonna do these little vids that, that I'm doing because I'm getting uh, my subscriber base. I'm getting them hyped up about it. Right. So uh, <laughs> I say, hey, man, I didn't mess with this guy. I didn't do nothing. I said this cat just thinks he can, uh, uh, you know, he's the God's greatest gift of fucking trucking. And if you don't uh, go by what he says or do what he says or whatever, he's gonna try to down you. And uh, and stuff like that, and, and he thinks that, you know, there's, you know, it's like I talked to a good friend of mine, good, good friend of mine, uh, Wild Beard, he actually commented on the last video, mm -hmm. like, I've hang out with that dude, uh, I, I, I've hung out with him, we went drinking together and everything, and uh, Wild Beard is a damn good dude, and he's still at Hertzbach, and he's doing good, but it's all because of his, uh, you know, he has a really good driver manager, and yada, 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 but I don't know where he was getting at to where, uh, I went over there for a recruiting bonus when I didn't even know nobody there. I just did a little bit of research. And, right. You know, you weigh your options, and you're like, all right, you know, it sounds, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to try it out. You know, it, it, it's just that's how, I, you know, I, I, I weigh it, and if I think the risk is something that's willing to do, especially if it's something that I can fucking walk away <laughs> from if it does Right, you, you did, down. I mean, this is your, like, I, like, you know, when we did the, when we did the video, I mean, it was just, it was, it was talking about your experience, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. So this, this is your, yeah. this is your experience with the company, you wasn't talking about the company per se, like, no, you wasn't, wasn't down, you wasn't, mouthing. you wasn't bad mouthing the company, you know, this is just an experience no. that you decide to, this was an experience that you decided to talk about it and you wanted to get yeah. your experience out there for the next person. Now, the next person that comes in, you know, they could say, oh, OK, well, this happened to B's knees. But this happened to him. That might not happen to me. And exactly. And they can elevate the risk. But at least they know, OK, you know, this is the chance that you're taking just like anything else you know there's a chance of that you could get someone bad and it still can happen to you um you know and, and i'm not saying that i was perfect while i was there but uh i'm not stupid about the decisions that i make <laughs> right and i mean i mean brother man how how do you uh, okay so 
I I remember another another video that uh that he did. This was a while back too. Um this was a this was a while back too that he did a uh, video and he mentioned in the video and I, I I believe I came back and responded to him. You know, usually I don't I don't do response videos. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I don't do response yeah. videos. I you know I try yeah, to you know I try to yeah. right I I try to stay away from the drama. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, if yeah, you, that's how that's how I am sometimes. But then I was like. Nah, man, this is kind of just knocking at my door. This guy right. called me an idiot and everything right. else. Right. And doesn't even have the balls to... Uh... Right. So he did. So when he did his video, he did his video, uh, he, what did he say? He said, uh, he said, uh... Uh, uncommon. No, 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 no. I'm talking about no, 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 no. Not, not the one on you. The one on me. I, the one that he did on me back in the day was... Uh, what he said? He said, "Uh, I'm not a fan of, I'm not a fan of somebody calling the recruiters and you know trying to get information out of them and recording them or some shit like that." And then he said, oh, he said yeah, something. Yeah, the guy, the guy he comes said, off like he's pro. Yeah, pro company. Period. Right, and he said but something. Company can never, never be wrong. Right. So he said something. He said something to the effect. He said something to the effect that uh, that uh, you know, what he doing? What he doing was you know, uh, inner uh, phone, uh, phone tap or some shit like that. But see, I came back and responded to the dude, and I was like, look. So I said, yeah, talk. Just, I said, yeah. talk what you know or some shit like that. I came back at him, but. <laughs> But how how did you how, how did you feel about that video when he made it, man? I mean, what what was your what was your feeling when when you when you when you seen it or heard it? Oh, I felt disrespected, man, because I felt like he's trying to um, obviously throw me out there. Obviously, knew who I was. I mean, if you watch the video, you even say who I am. And I've been on your channel. What this is my third third time on your channel. Yeah. Um. Yeah, so it, it's no hidden secret, and uh, I just feel like some of the stuff that he said, he was kind of trying not to mention any names, but make it directly um, to the point where you know he's, uh, you know, he, he, he's throwing some low blow insults. Yeah, you know, it's, it's like someone, uh, it's like someone walking by him, mumbling underneath their breath. Mm-hmm. You know, but don't uncommonly uncommon sense. Don't have the balls to say it to your fan. And I've always been like that. Like if you go, if you have a problem or if I'm doing something, just tell me. You know, just hey, bro. You know, holler at me. You know, there's no reason for you to be uh, very indirect. And that's how he came off. And I felt, you know, um, because I'm just I'm more of a straight shooter kind of guy. Um, that uh, you call call me an idiot and stupid and and you know say all this this fluff of uh, you know pretty much insulting you know who I am not only the decision that I made because you feel it it was a bad decision okay well that's your your thoughts about it um, but but then start to uh, just pretty much attack me as as a person and then that's when i take it a little bit different when you start you know uh call me names or or, we'll call you chip. or so on because uh those those are uh that, that's something where you tell me to my face you know you you tell me i'm stupid or whatever you know we're, we're gonna throw hands <laughs> i got you now you know what i never you know what like i said i i seem to do get into it with with a lot of YouTubers, he got into it with uh, Nesbitt. He got into it with uh, Little Guy. He got into it with uh, Little Dog, uh, J uh, James Hensley. Man, James Hensley went at him hard. No, you want to know who went at him hard? <laughs> you want to know who went at him harder? Uh, that dude, no. uh, Jason, Jason Pulp, the, the coach dude. Yeah, he he uh, yeah, went he yeah, went at him good. he went at him like for a good minute, man, for a good minute, and then you got yeah, I know, they, they, I know they hate each other. Yeah, <laughs> and then you got uh then you got uh uh Ike Stevens that uh that went at him. My only thing my my only thing is 
my only thing was that I, I looked at all this and I was like, huh, you know, this this cat, I, I was watching him. I'm, I'm still subscribed to him. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, I'm still subscribed to him. Right, I'm, I'm know, still I'm subscribed to him. You know, it, you know yeah. sometimes, you know, sometimes when he comes on to talk, you know, he, you know, pass the time, you know, just to hear him ramble on or whatever, whatever. But <laughs> the thing that got me back in the day was he was like maybe about a year, a year or two, maybe a year and a half in, and he started talking coaching calls. And, and everybody yeah. was talking about it, like Ike, yeah. Little Dog, and everybody like, yo, how the hell this dude, with only a year, year and a half, maybe less than two years, is charging. He's going to give coaching advice. Right, is, and, and charge. charging for it. Yeah, that's wrong. That's wrong. You know, and when he said at one point in his video, he was like, well, you know, he's a hustle guy. This is a hustle, and this is what I do, I hustle. Then I finally put it together. I was like, oh, okay, okay, this is a hustle for him. You know what I'm saying? And I yeah. never – I'm a hustler myself. I never knock another yeah. person's hustle. So if the coaching yeah. calls was a hustle and somebody calling you up two-year driver that only drove for GMP for for two years and, you know, you drove drive in for two years and you try to tell somebody the same stuff that they can find out on on the Internet for free. That they can find for free. For free. And that person want to give you 30, 30 or $60. By all means, go and get that money, bro. I come here to help, but y'all out for blood. I'm not answering no more questions. I I never yeah. I, I never said I, I never came out and said, hey, I, I think it's wrong what you doing, bruh. I never came out and said that. Yeah. But I have came no, out. I, I never I never bashed him or nothing. Right. And I never you know, and I'll be honest with you, I've never thought much of the dude, but I've never bashed him. I've never done because typically I'm not gonna do something like that unless I just straight up don't agree with that. I only did one time and that was with uh, Mark Anthony Storm because he flat out lied about. Oh yeah, uh, yeah, sense. yeah. I had to, I had to come back yeah. and I had to come back and because somebody, one of my subscribers even hit hit me to it because I was like, I was like, wow, that that yeah. was crazy. And Mark Anthony flat out lied. Uh, yeah, on, he on flat that out dude. lied, and I, that that hit me on a different different yeah, level. Yeah, When you're uh, you're you're lying, you call yourself with this, especially military. You know, I mean, mm -hmm. being previous military, and then then you're you, you're saying all these. You know, you hold yourself to these values, and then you're lying on another man on something so serious that cannot. Ruin his reputation, but his career, his children away, divorce, his career. Right. I mean, there's just so many repercussions. Those are some serious accusations. And luckily, and when he was flat out lying, luckily, he, luckily, you know, made sense. Was you know when he did his thing and he had his wife put him like his wife. Yeah. You know that was right there. That that yeah. was a beautiful thing, man. That made him uh mm, uh uh. Mm. <laughs> Uh, yeah. uh, and then, yeah, yeah, that part, that part right there. So that was like the only time that I came out about somebody. Because other than that, I'm going to let it go because I'm trying to have a very, uh, just a fun channel. Something that's right. informative sometimes, sometimes to show you what I'm doing, what I'm cooking. You know, I just have random, you know, right. uh, uh, my channel is just a little bit diverse. But with something where someone can watch it, if they're having a stressful day, and they can just be like, you know, get a laugh out of something that I said that was stupid or whatever. But, you know, when someone personally comes at me, well, then, uh, oh, you, you know, I'm not, I'm not stupid. Uh, I'm a... You know, I'm a clown, yeah. <laughs> I, yo, I, I, I'm seeing some of the, I'm seeing some of the videos that you got out on this cat, man, and it's, it's, it's funny as fuck. But I, I just wanted, yeah. I, I just wanted to come back and, I, I just wanted to come back and talk to you and be like, yo, when I, when I seen the video, I was like. At first, it, it didn't done on me. That's that was the problem. It didn't it didn't actually hit me until I got deep into the video. And that's and I'm about to let yeah. you know I'm about to let you know, bro. That's that's how I watch your videos, man. That's how I know 
you know, to let you know that I watch your videos, literally. I mean, you know, I don't, well, I don't watch, watch them, but, you yeah. know, your video was playing while I was driving. And that's when I was yeah. like, wait a minute. Is he talking about this dude? Wait. I, I had to step. I had to, I'm over here driving. I'm like, wait a minute. Hold up. Interview. <laughs> lease. <laughs> chip. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Yeah, Is he talking about this? And he over way, here calling you out of your name? 99 cents a mile. Yeah. I was like, I didn't even say that. Oh, I said it was a sliding scale. Right. With the low end of 99 cents. And if you... Just pay attention to the wording. Right. Riding scale. Right. <laughs> so I'm, I'm over here driving. I'm like, wait a minute. Is he talking? And then when you came back, when you came out with the first video, and I was like, oh, my God. he was. I, I said, he's talking about my dude. I said, okay. Okay. Yeah. Well, uh, I, w what is this, bro? I mean, what is this? I mean, you... I mean, no, nobody. Like I said, uh, look, no, no shots fired, man. No shots fired to me. You know, you, yo, you, you do whatever you do on your YouTube. I respect you. I don't have no problems against you. Never did. Never will. But yeah, you. I don't know. Before you even open your mouth about you know about somebody or something like that, or you trying to give your opinion or something like that. You might not want to do that. I mean, you probably might want to come yeah. back. You probably might want to come back and make a video about this video right here. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker, you need to put his ass on a foot post so far out in the sticks that he's going to see the Philadelphia cops walking towards him. But I'm, yeah. I'm just saying, you know, I, I, I was surprised that, that he would even say, you know, had an opinion or say anything about it, man. That that's that would that would kind of struck me right there. Oh yeah, it's just I mean, just like I said, when he went with the personal insults, that mm -hmm. that takes it to a whole another level. And I know he's being very direct with it. And if nobody, you know, my subscriber count, you know, has increased. Uh, so you know, I'm sure there's a couple of my subscriber base, you know, that listen to him, and they're like, hey, they're talking about. Help these means over right. here, you know? Oh, what's this dude, you know? What, you trying to, you trying to clown me now? And, and oh, make me out to be like a fool, like I wasn't transparent? And that's why I said, you know, if, if uh, you know, Red Viking, if um, you watched any of my videos, the very first video was 45 fucking minutes long, <laughs> and it was about a <laughs> I mean, that, I mean, like I said, when we when we first, you know, when we first did the very first interview together, the the very first interview together yeah. that we did, you 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 was Wolf Hirschbach and you was praising yeah. you was praising Hirschbach at uh, at the time, yeah. you know. So what do you? So what do you? That's why I said pretty much. And the last one is just it's been my driver manager, and I'm glad that that interview that you did with her spot that uh lady that followed mm -hmm. up with you you know i have i have a lot of respect with what she said uh mm -hmm. you know that 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 makes me feel that the company you know does live up to its values i understand that you know the owner and, and stuff can't control you know how their drivers managers uh, uh manage right. you know you just when it comes down to you can't control how people manage and p people manage a whole different ways right and it just so happened that I got a bad, bad man. And it's always more people put on to her. And, and, you know, I just kind of got forgotten about. It, almost it's, in a way. And it's always, like I said before, it's, it's always the manager. You have a good rapport with the manager. You're yeah. going to have a, you're going to have an awesome time with the company. If you and the manager the company, don't yeah. get along with each other, then that's was going to make your time with the company sucks. Take your time. I, yeah. I say, yeah. I, I say that why, all the time. Try to make, yeah, and that's what I try to make clear in the video was like, hey, I don't have nothing against the owner. Mm -hmm. I don't have nothing against the recruiter. It was just with the driver manager. That's right. all it was. And, and this and guy coming over say, here, that's, this, that's this, what it is. this guy coming <laughs> over here talking, talking about, you know, talking about the lease yeah, and went, and what, what was the what, what was the what was the, the the theme of his video? Uncommon, common, uncommonly, uncommon sense. Uncommon sense, 
Uncommon, unco- uncommon, un- un- common uncommon sense. Uncommon, uncommon sense. Yeah. Yeah, un- the uncommon, uncommon sense. Yeah, and then... Co- and I was like, this... I, Dude, I, I, like I said, I, I didn't know, man. I, I, I honestly, I, I honestly. But then when I started reach, uh, listening, listening to the video yeah. and and listening more and more, and I'm like, this dude talking about bees knees, man. Like, what the fuck? Oh yeah, like my next video is I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch his, uh, his live stream because I downloaded it on my laptop. Mm-hmm. So I'm gonna film myself, and it's gonna be like a reaction to his. Uh, oh, to, to his, his live stream. stream. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, man, like I said, this dude, like I said, you know, he, I mean, you know, at, in the beginning, you know, in the, in the beginning, you know, I, I, I had some respect. I had a little bit of marginal respect for the dude. You yeah. know what I'm saying? A little bit. But still, you know, like I said, still, he, you know. Try to be uh, like you he's this. Don't come he's, at me on a personal level. But he's trying to come. He's trying to come like he's this trucking guru. Like thinking short when they should be thinking long. Shameful shit. Yes. Yes. Really? Yes. Like, and bro, that, you you. And that's not what a, I said in my short little two minute video. I said, you know, when I'm feeling tired and feeling sleepy and the coffee isn't doing it and the energy drinks ain't having it. Well, God damn it, I'm going to put on RVT. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, how many, how many companies he drove for so far? He over here talking about, oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, 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 wait. Here's my, fa- no, this is my favorite. This this is my favorite saying that he always do. I'm going to show you how to make uh, six figures. Six figures this and yeah. six figures that. I'm going to show you how to do six figures in, in trucking. And, yes, you can do six figures yeah, and, in trucking. And, 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 that's, and, and I'm and like. And I hate when he says that because he's the, I know who watch who a lot of people watch him are, are, new, are new, new people. Right. And it's like, don't tell them that they can make six figures because the chances are. They're not going to. Did I within my first year? Yeah. But I was fortunate because I was with the union. Mm -hmm. You know, that's how I came into trucking. Mm -hmm. My dad got me in with the union. Mm -hmm. But is that, you know, typical? No, that's not typical. No, it's not. The typical person is going to start at Prime or Swift or Mm -hmm. Pam Mm -hmm. or whoever. And they're not going to see cis figures at that place. I could tell you that now. No, they're Maybe. Not going, hold they're up, not, hold up. No, they, not going wait, to wait, wait, wait. They might see it at Prime. They they might. They they, they well, might. Yeah, a yeah, little might. Yeah, might. Some people at Prime. At Prime, but I, I don't know about Pam and Swift and U.S. Express and the rest of them. Nah, no, nah, you, you're, you're not, not going to yeah, see them yeah, six no. figures. You, you're not. But that's yeah. that's my favorite saying that this dude be coming out with like, yo, uh, there's six figures. I'm going to show you how to get six figures and, you know, come <laughs> call me on my coaching call so I can show you how to get six figures. I'm like, yeah, yeah, come on. dude, you over here talking about how you going to show somebody to get six figures, but yet you, 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 you bounce from company to company to company. What, where, where were you? G, G and P, G, G and P. Uh, did he do GMP, FedEx, GMP, FedEx, oil field Dave? Was he with him? Yeah, he was with the oil, oil field a little bit, right? And now he's doing what tankers with some company, I yeah, guess. I think he, he, yeah, I think he went back to tanking, just not. In the oil field, yeah. I don't know if he's doing water or yeah. or what, but it's some form of tanking. So where 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 are we at? Five? Where are we at? Four? Five? Six? Yeah, yeah, he's you know yeah, within the short you know in the short time that he's been in trucking for like <laughs> for like three four years, and you gonna yeah. try and tell some you gonna try to teach somebody to get fit six figures, but you couldn't do it yeah. at GMP, you couldn't do it at FedEx. You couldn't do it in the oil fields, but yet you still going to try and show somebody how to get six figures. Look, it takes money to make money, Strang. Otherwise, hell, every pauper be a king. I like your hustle, yeah, man. Yeah, come on, man. I, I like your hustle. Is somebody going to call? <laughs> is somebody going to pay you thirty dollars for just the, for oh, thirty yeah, minutes? I'll take any motherfucker's money if he's giving it away. When it comes down to it, I'll give him this. 
He's a good salesman. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I got it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. For sure. Uh, hold on. Wait, wait. Oh, hold on. There we go. Uh, I'll give you that, bro. I give you that. And again, and again, no shots fired. No, none taken. You know what I'm God saying? Damn, no shots fired at yeah. you, bro, because this is you. You even said yourself that I'm a hustler. You know, I'm howling and I'm ho hooping and hollering and woofing down the down the highway. You know, hey, yeah. I get you, bro. I get you. You know, you trying to make your YouTube. You trying to make your YouTube the yeah, standard. Trying, trying to make a uh, yeah another income. Mm -hmm. You know, which I have nothing against that. That's. You know, that's the majority of what people, you know, are on YouTube. They're, they're, it's a different stream of revenue, you know. It may not be much, but it's a different stream. And I you, don't see nothing wrong with that. You know what? I, but I, then when people... Uh, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, nah, but then when I see is people that just blatantly trying to, uh, you know, it's almost like a scam in a way. Like, mm -hmm. come on, <laughs> I, I'll, I'll give him this. Don't take advantage of people. I, I'll give him this. He he knows how to do the YouTube algorithm. She because he told he told that dude Jim uh what's that cat's name uh Trucking Jim Jim Trucking Journey. He told Jim. Oh yeah. yeah he yeah. told he told Jim. Jim actually came out and said, "Yo, you know, here's a secret to YouTube." You know, and, and showed him the YouTube algorithm. Jim said in his one of his videos, and yes, he got into it with Jim too. But uh he said in one of his yep, videos yep. he said in one of his videos that uh that old boy showed him how much he was getting from YouTube. That's the faucet. Shit, as far as the federal money's concerned, he's everything. The faucet, the goose. Oh, goose. The one that lays them golden eggs. <laughs> And Jim, yeah. and I, you know, I, I take Jim at face value. You know what I'm saying? You know, Jim, funny guy. You know, he's like the Gomer. <laughs> no, let me do this. No, no shots fired, bro. But he's like the Gomer, he's like the Gomer Powell of, uh, of YouTube. You know, he got good videos. He knows how, he knows now, you know, he can't, I follow Jim also, you know, because me and him worked it for U.S. Express for a minute. So that's how long, that's how long I've been following Jim. But, you know, oh, wow. but, uh, but, um. When Jim came back and said, "Yeah, he showed me how how to do the YouTube av algorithm and all like that," and when Jim said how much money he seen that he do was pulling in from YouTube, that's when Jim Jim started you know to start taking some cues from the man. So you like start every taking, yeah, start, every time you hear taking it seriously. right, so every time you heard <laughs> like heard heard him say keywords like big wheel, sixteen wheel, big. CDL trucking big this and all like that. Yeah, the algorithm big. would catch up. Take your werewolf ball. Right, <laughs> right. The algorithm would pick up on that, and I was like, I was like, huh? Yeah. So that's how yeah, he does. He uses the same tag. Yeah, so that's I'd be like it's the same tag right. over and over again. Right, and that's how I, I was. And that's why in my video I use the same tags that uh that RVT does. I know by using his tags mm -hmm. that my video will be placed. With his videos, yeah, that's why I was like, huh, "This man's a, this man's a hustler." Boy, I tell you, we bled that motherfucker. I gotta give it to him. Hey, this boy, this boy doing the damn thing. But look, man, hey, look, like I said, uh, like I said, bees knees. I, you know, like I said, I, I didn't want to, I, I didn't want to talk about it, but I, I had to bring you back because. I figured you 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 had something you had something to say, and you felt some kind of way. So that's why I, that's why I brought you back, man. Because like I said, I I saw the video. I didn't to be honest with you. I didn't take too keen on the video. You know what I'm saying? Because I I just kind of felt that if it's like my mom's always say, if you don't have nothing good to say. Don't say it at all, man. Yeah. He's the man. Don't say it all, man. He's, you, don't, he's, you don't know the person on a personal level. Don't be attacking him personally. Exactly. You can attack me. Trucking career, you can tell me, you know, I, I messed up that. But when you start insulting my intelligence or, or whatever the case is, you know, I, uh, 
I'll do well with personal attacks, especially when you, you don't even fucking know me. And, and my story for the night. Exactly. And he <laughs> was the now now before before we go, man, I, I mean, you know, like I said, no no shots fired to you, bro. None at all. But you was the main one that was saying back in the day how you felt how other drivers came after after you and you didn't like that. You didn't like how how Bubba uh Bubba Nesbitt came at you. James Hensley, Ike Stevens, Little Dog, Little Guy, uh the trucker's coach. You didn't like how they all came after you because you said yourself that, oh well, they don't know me and you know, they don't know who I am, but look at what you did to this dude right here, man. You don't know him and you and and you made no. you you made an opinionated video without without even knowing the guy. You just came without even checking the very first video. Right. You just came on and said, Hey, you know, I saw this interview and you know, uncommon common un uncommonly uncommon sense. Com whatever the fuck you said. But still, you you didn't like how the other guys came after you though. But look at what you did. Now you're gonna now you probably, which you might do, come back and make another video to say something what we said about you right now. You know what I'm saying? But that's only because my man right here is coming back after you because you said something about him. We ain't even mention your name in that in, in the video. We ain't say nothing about, as you hear, my man is mentioning your name. Me, I haven't said your name yet. You see what I'm saying? I probably did. Yeah. Let me see. Did I say? Did I say yeah. RVT? <laughs> 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 but, that's, but, you know, like I said, man, again, no shots fired at you or nothing like that, man. My man wanted to come back on, clear the air. He wanted to clear the air and all like that. You know, my you you can come on my forum, you can come on my platform and 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 say what you want to say. I, I don't mind. You know what I'm saying? I don't have no beast with nobody. I don't say what you say. Right. You know? I don't have no beast yeah, with nobody. You want to come on? Right. He could have called, like I said, my phone number's out there. He could have called me up and say, hey, lockout man, uh I, I had something to say about uh about a uh, bee's knees uh, video on on leasing, <laughs> or better yet, you could have put yourself in the comment session. You could have said something down in the comment session. You know what I'm saying? But you said yourself back in the day you don't like truck, you don't like YouTubers coming after you. But look at what you're doing. What what you call that? Oh, yeah, well, he being even started. But call me stupid, uncommon sense. Mm -hmm. uh, there's words about I live in my mom's basement mm -hmm. or whatever. <laughs> I mean, Jesus Christ. Yeah. I mean, there's just so much. Like, you know what? Like, I, you on, know what? Bro. I don't, you don't, even, don't even know. Me. Un unfortunately, my internet is not all that all that crispy right now. But I I I, I will have parts of, of of the video in this video. Just letting you know, just in case you wanna. Call yeah. uh, if you want to call YouTube and and let them know that I'm, you know, using bits and pieces of the video. Just saying, but <laughs> but I'm just saying, man. I, look, I I respect your hustle. That's that, let's get this clear. I respect your hustle. You think I have time to ask a man why he giving me money or where he gets his money from? This video right here is not a bash video or nothing like that. I respect your hustle, man. You know what I'm saying? Hey, somebody want to call you up yeah. and give you give you thirty, sixty, a hundred dollars or something like that, and you you know, and you just want to you know give them your experience because basically that's what it is. You know, hey, by all means, I'll take any motherfucker's money if he giving it away. Yeah, well, I don't. Shit, teach me how to do it. Hey, hey, you want to call me up? You you want to call me? You, hey, y'all, guys, y'all want to call me up and give me $100, $60 for me to tell you something that you can just take your time and find out on the Internet? Shit, I'll take your money, too. I'll take any motherfucker's money if he's giving it away. I'll take anybody's yeah. money if I'll take anybody's money if y'all willing to give it to me. <laughs> Shit. Shit, boy. <laughs> <laughs> y'all y'all know what my I mean, man when it comes out to a youtuber well youtubers want to announce or not you know it's a 
it's a platform that gives knowledge, yes. right, to other people. Yes. That's why that's why people watch trucking channels to see what other truckers do, mm-hmm. this, that, and the third. Mm-hmm. But when you try to manipulate that into almost not even a hustle, but almost into like a false narrative, like you could come out here your first year and make a hundred grand immediately. Nah, man. Don't- <laughs> You said you, you said that's not gonna happen. I, I I've been out here for five years, bro, and I still haven't seen six figures. Mm-mm. Twenty gets you the permits. Five is for me for bribing these downtown motherfuckers. You tell tell me what I'm doing wrong, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Tell me what I'm doing wrong. Yeah. You know what? Do I need to stay? Do I need to stay out? Do I need to switch lanes? What? Tell tell me what I need to do. You know what I'm saying? I, just like you gave Jason Pope that free, uh, that free trucking coaching call that you did on that video, yo, hook hook me up, man. Get t- give me the game because me and you both been in the game for just about the same amount of time, man. So tell me what I tell me what I don't know in this game, man. Think I'm gonna be the scapegoat for the whole damn machine? She. I, I talk to the same people. I talk to owner operators, just like you do. You do the interviews with the owner operators. I do the interviews with the owner operators too. I talk to owner operators. I'm not into uh I'm not into uh real estate, but I probably might be moving to that soon. You know what I'm saying? But you know, as far as this trucking goes, shit, me and you pretty much do the same same thing, bro. Except I, Same you know, thing, man. except, you know, I got a nice little background and, you know, you, you know, just turn the camera on and you got, <laughs> you, you got, you know, s- stuff around. I I need to know how you do that too, man. I, I need to know how you do that too. Uh, hook me up. Hook me up with that sponsor. I, I think that Falcon, that Falcon ad. Yeah. Hook me up with them, bro. Even though yeah. I, even, even though I can call even though I can call up the company and say hey you know I got X amount of uh, subscribers too and I, I like to promote your product yeah look I, I, you see what I'm saying I can do that too <laughs> so I'm just saying I, I, I'm just saying but again no shots fired bro. No, no shots fired. So, uh, bees knees, man. Nah. Would you? And that's the thing, like with me, I'm not, I'm not a violent person. I'm not out here looking to uh, throw hands with anybody. But you know, when you disrespect people on a personal level, you know, people start to wonder why. I'm, mean, I'm just saying, you know, obvious reasons. Is, is it something that I, I'm ever going to do? Because I'm, I'm a clear up too, you know. Because I want the guy. Oh, oh he's going to see me and want to throw. No, that's not the thing, but. You know, uh, before you start bashing people on a very personal level, um, you know, you just maybe you should think about what the hell comes out of your mouth and, and, and do, do a little bit more fucking research prior to uh, uh, stating your opinion on the matter of the fact. But um, needless to say, it was, you know, disrespectful. I took it on a disrespectful note. Um, and and I, I shouldn't let stuff happen like that coming from a person that doesn't even know me but uh you know you know that that's that's uh that's the beast of it you know people uh you know are going to bash you uh, and they're going to judge you especially other truckers truckers are judgmental yeah and, we um, all are you know that's, we that's, all are. that's, I, I, that's the nature yeah, of the beast. I, 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 give you, I you said you, that that's a that's a freaking truth we are all judgmental man we are yeah. all judgmental, man. But like I said, you know, you got judgmental. Everyone wants to kind of one up each other or whatever, and it, and it's just like I have friends this day still at Hertzbach. I had one comment in my last video, and uh, he said, you know, uh, bees knees. He said, uh, even though you're not with Hertzbach, he said, uh, he said, man, you're a brother to me, and uh, he said, uh, I, I I support you in all calls. That's Interstate Tuna Tuna, and uh, he he's one of my loyal subscribers. Uh, and uh, that means a lot, man, you know, and I think that as truckers, that that's where we need to be is just more uh, looking out for one. I mean, hell, look, there, there's truckers getting robbed. There's truckers. Getting, yeah, it's a lot of crazy uh, shit that's up. going and, on. And, then, yeah, and you got a, and you got this and, and, and you and, and you got you got people that want to start 
YouTube beefs, uh, beef, for, and for what? Yeah, for nothing. Yeah, YouTube beef for what? You know, because you want to because you want to give your opinion on leasing, and that's the thing. Like, there's more than one way to own a truck. Yeah, it may not be the way that you want to do it. It may not be the way you would even go about or sit the, in the driver's the seat. Uncommon, so like common, said. uncommon, <laughs> common sense, common, uncommonly, uncommon sense. Chip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean that's okay. I mean, uh, I'm, I know I'm gonna, he's gonna listen to this, uh, and yeah, I'm, I'm gonna call him. You know, the, the videos are not gonna stop. I'm, I'm gonna continue them and just to prove a point that, uh, you know, don't don't clown people, man. If you don't want to be clowned yourself, I, I'm gonna and call him. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna call him Chip. <laughs> <laughs> at least you could have called the man. At least you could have called the man's name out. At least I would have caught up on it. I mean, you see yeah, how you see how slow yeah, see see out. how slow I was picking it up, and B's knees picked it up real quick, and I'm still trying to figure out, huh? Is he talking about B's knees? <laughs> hey, <laughs> lock, the ring, like, ring, in the ring, 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 lockout, lock, lockout, hey. Lockout. He's talking about me on that video. What? Wait a minute, bees knees. He's talking about you. I was like, wait, hold up, man. You, you. I had to go back and watch it again. Fucking talking about me. Oh my god. Where did this come from? Oh, I said. I, then I said, I was like, huh, thank you for still watching my channel, though, bro. Okay. That goes to show you that. <laughs> yeah, hey. I mean, it, it supports the algorithm. Hey, he supports the algorithm. There you go. Support the algorithm. That's, I should come up with a T-shirt. Support the algorithm. RVT. <laughs> Hashtag. <laughs> <laughs> Well, hey, man, I, uh, man, we we about to get on up out of here. Yo, Bees Knees, thanks for coming on, man. And as always, Bees Knees is a definite friend of the show. If you guys like content like this and more, man, don't forget to like, subscribe. Wait a minute. If you guys like content like this, make sure you take that Viking werewolf paw of yours right here, that paw, and make sure you smash that like button. Smash that like button with your Viking paw. <laughs> and oh wait with your viking finger hit that all button so that you can get all notifications when i post videos like this man yo bees knees man thanks for coming on you know like i said i it's it's not about it's not about beefing it's not about uh it's not about beefing or nothing like that but you know he, he it's like he said, man, he felt some kind of way. And, you know, since he did it on my platform, you know, and, I, you know, I give him my platform and you're very welcome to come on my platform, bruh. Very welcome to come on my platform. I mean, if you want to do the video side by side, let me know. Hit me up at the Gmail. That's lockoutmanpodcast at gmail.com. Or get at me on the phone number, man, 216-600-2090. You can get me there. And then we can set something up on Sunday, and we, we, we can chop it up, man. We can chop it up. Bees knees, man. How you feel about that? Hey, man, that, that's, you know, if you're going to, if you have something to say that bad, just you know, contact that person, contact the channel that you want to go on, and 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 hit them up and get on the platform. I think that is a fair, fair, very fair offer. And if you don't, then maybe you just like insinuating stuff to people, you know, without even just just calling them by name. We will you know, all other than the easy targets and we, whatever else. We will you all know, be on. We will all be on here. I'll bet you can come on. I will come on. I will mediate. And I will bring B's knees on, and then y'all y'all can conversate about you know, you know how you feel about leasing. right about <laughs> leasing. You know how you feel about leasing, and how he feel about leasing, and I'll mediate. That's that's all. Lockout Man Podcast. Ooh, let's make that happen, bro. I, hey, I like that. And you know what? I will make it. Let's make it for a Sunday because 
we could get that good internet connection. And we could we could do the we could we can do the 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 sound lap or the 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 sound lap thing. We could do it, man. Let's do it. Hey, I'm I'm hype. Oh, you got me hype. Hold on, I gotta play my music. I'm hype. You see what I'm saying? See that? I had to stop my music. I am hype. I'm ready. <laughs> Woo! Hit me up, bro, because I'm gonna. This is gonna. I'm, I'm gonna hurry up and try to chop this up and get it out. Let's do it. I'm hype, man. I'm hype. All three of us together, lockout men, RVT and B's knees. Man, just imagine the viewer numbers. Let's do it, man. Just imagine the viewer numbers <laughs> on that night. And we can. Oh, wait, wait. Here's another thing too, RVT. We can simulcast it. I can. I can go live. I can go live on mine, and you can go live on yours at the same damn time. Woo! Let's do it, man. Let's do it. Lockout, man. Bees knees. We're out of here. As you walk into the room, smash that like button with your Viking wear.